Well, hello everyone, and welcome to another edition of Talking Bullion. Well, I got me a little box in the mail today. Pretty excited about this one. I've kind of went off the board a little bit with my normal stacking. You know, premiums being so high and stuff. I mean, you got to buy something, right? If you're a stacker, you want to keep stacking. But you don't want to get out of control with your stacking or really impact your dollar cost averaging by buying a ton. So we've changed a little bit. Uh, still having to pay the premiums like everybody else. But instead of going with the really high premium stuff, uh, well, I mean, <laughs> this one's kind of high premium. But I think it's uh, reasonable, and I think it adds to the stack nicely. And I think it's just kind of a new direction that I've been going lately. So enough about that. Why don't we just jump on in here and take a look at what I'm talking about. Alright, and I'm also doing a different angle today. I'm trying to trying to come at it from the side instead of the top, usually from the top, but I wanted to get a little bit better angle from the side. I don't know. I want to try a few videos like that, so we'll see how it works. If it doesn't work, we'll switch back to the old way. And I think maybe just sometimes we'll switch to this way, but let's see how this works out. Alright, so I bought this directly from the manufacturer. They actually had a, you know, decent price and as the price of silver changes daily hourly minutely whenever it changes it reflects a change on their website as well now I did pay for it by check which means I had to wait a little while and uh, that's okay I don't want to pay more than I have to so I'm willing to do the check so it looks very nicely wrapped oh man it's got, got some weight some weight in there. All right. Oh, it's got a nice little pull tab here. Let's pull this tab. Open it up. Oh, that, was, that was easy. <laughs> and let's see what we have. Take a little peek. We got the camera from. Oh, looks like we got some chunkies down there. Ooh. Get those out of there and see what we have. Oh yes. So here we go. Alright, so let's take a look at one up close. These are the YPS, which stands for Jaeger's Poured Silver. Very popular minting company, very popular pouring company. These are the 100 gram chunkers. And they are chunky. So they are also serialized, right? This is 911. Hmm. And this is 912. And this is 910. I bought three and three at a time so I could get them in order. So that's pretty cool. And let's get one of these out of here. I'm not going to leave them in, in the plastic. I don't think that's necessary. If my silver gets a little toning done on it, that's okay with me. That's what silver does. But I want to I wanna feel the weight of this thing without the plastic. Oh, yeah. That is one nice, chunky bar. 99, 9 plus fine. So I can't seem to get the uh, good look on it from this angle. But uh, what I want to do is kind of stack them. I want to start stacking these bars. So it looks like my uh, camera's having a hard time focusing. There we go. That's a better look. 999 plus, fine. You can see the YPS of Jaeger's poured silver up there on the top. Let's look at that serial number. 910. Look at that thing shine. Is that awesome or what? Wow, this is really, really cool. So what do you guys think, huh? Pretty cool. Got two more of them. Let's go ahead and free them from their plastic prison. Oh man, the weight on these things is incredible. 
love these. Uh, I love the weight of these 100 grammers. And I recently showed a video where I just bought a 100 gram Scottsdale. I'll get that one out and show you the difference between two because they're same weight but quite a bit different uh, bars. So we get this focus. Looks like those are hand stamped. See the variation on them. 912. So 912 is on. So you have to rotate it like that to see the number. Look at that, huh? All right. So now my goal is to get 10 of them. And I'm going to stack me some silver bars. If I get 10 of these, I'll have a fractional kilo bar, which is what I'm trying to do. So why don't you let me go get the Scottsdale bar. We'll take a look at the difference between the two. All right, so I got the Scottsdale bar. Let's take a look at that one. That's a nice looking piece of silver, huh? Is that pretty cool or what? Yeah, but look at the difference. Both 100 grams. Same weight. All right. Look at this chunky, thick one. And the Scottsdale is much flatter. You know, they both feel great in the hand. Pretty awesome. But just different styles. Different way now. Um, Scottsdale does have, you know, their version of chunky ones as well. 10, 10 ounces for sure. They've got two different kinds of 10 ounces. They got the stackables. They got ones that are like this that are just chunks. That's what they call them. But Scottsdale's out of stock. You can't go to Scottsdale website and order these. You have to get them off eBay or someplace else. Whereas the Jaeger Sport Silver, they've got them in stock on their website. You can, uh, at least last I look, you can go out there and you can order some. And as soon as my check cleared, they got them in the mail. And I actually got them in like two days, I think, from when they shipped them. But I think they're pretty close. Uh, I think they're based out of Ohio. But yeah, look at the difference between those two, huh? Pretty nice. So yeah, I got this stackable right there. I really like those a lot. So here's a... 400 grams or just a 100 gram bar from being half of a kilo. All right, so what I thought we'd do next is weigh them. I'm going to put on my Sigma Metalytics verifier, the three bars I just got in. But with the angle I'm on right now, I don't think it'll show up well. But I thought maybe it'd be cool to kind of weigh them. So I've got the scale set at grams. We're not doing troy ounces or anything right now. We're just going to do the grams. We'll put it on there and let's see if you can see that. This says 100.4. That's awesome. A little over. Let's take a look at this one. It says 100.6. So that's cool. All right. And let's take a look at this one. What do we have here? We've got another 100.4. So the three of them. Let's see what they weigh out to. 301.3 grams. Awesome. Got a little bit more. A little bit extra. It's a 912. It's a 911. And that is the 910. Alright. So cool, huh? I'm already enjoying stacking the bars over here. Let's just throw this, uh, oh, let's tear it, got a little bit extra on there. And let's just throw the Scottsdale on there, let's see what that weighs up to. Yeah, the Scottsdales I've ordered in the past have been quite a bit heavier. That's 101.5. Awesome, so this, this bar has more in it, has as much extra in it as these three combined. Alright, 301.5, so... This bar alone has as much extra silver in it as all three of these combined. I don't know how much to scale away, but there we are. 403 grams of pure 999 silver. Some fine silver. I love these Scottsdales, but these Jaegers, these are really, really nice. 
probably will be ordering some more. Probably I'd like to one day get 10 of these and 10 of these. These are a little bit easier to obtain right now because you can buy them off the manufacturer's website. These are not. These you have to find in the uh, secondary market, which I actually just ordered uh, some off of uh, eBay. Atmux actually had these on eBay for cheaper than what they saw them at Scottsdale for. But of course at Scottsdale, you can't buy them right now. And so Atmux had them for cheaper than you can get them off the uh, mid site for. And they had like 23 available and they just kind of popped up on, on eBay one day. And I was like, huh, are these 10 grams? Are these because the price was so much less than uh, buying them off a user on eBay? Like it was like $40 less, $40 to $50 less. So anyway, I uh, ordered a couple of them. And sure enough, those things sold out like a couple hours at most. There's 23 of them sold out really quick. And... Uh, now they say they're not going to get them till mid-April or something, so, you know, several weeks out. But that's okay. <laughs> you know what, folks? If I'm going to get a good deal, I do not mind waiting. Why would I mind waiting to get a fantastic deal on some silver, right? So, yeah, let's get this scale out of here. Let's bring these chunkers back in here. And the Scott's deal. You know, no disrespect to... Jaegers by putting the Scottsdale on the screen. Just want to kind of show, uh, show them both because they're both beautiful bars, but they're a little bit different, right? Both 100 grams, but uh, one's, uh, one's chunky and one isn't. So yeah, if you just put two of them next to each other for a moment. Boy, I'll tell you. All right. How about that, huh? But I like them stacked. Yeah, stack me some bars. Look at that. Look at that. Are those beautiful or what? All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed the silver bar stack. And I'm sure you'll be seeing some more as I pick some of these up online, eBay. Uh, get a hold of Jaegers again, order a few more bars. Probably should have ordered them all at once so I could have had the nice consecutive numbers. But you know, it's got to have a budget, right? It's got to be a budget in there. Well, that's it for now. Thank you for watching. And always remember, let's keep talking bullion.